Traders of the Yeji market in the Pru East district of the Bono East region say they are under severe risk of either losing their lives or their earnings each time they visit the Yeji market. According to these traders, highway robbers have been terrorizing them on the roads to and from their communities. The situation to them is worrying as it's in turn affecting business activities within the area. James Humado is the community secretary of Wutideke, a community along the Volta Lake. A community like Wutideke, armed robbers always tacking as every present day. In fact, a special market day, Sunday, Monday and Tuesday. If you pass that way, you will never get yourself freely. Always, day and night. Even sometimes they, they attack uh, these uh, Okada people and they get the motto from them. Even if you carry a basket or you carry anything at all, they can catch, they can catch you and then beat you. Even without any money too, they will just wounded you and then go away. So we are, we are appealing for the, uh, the government to help us. In fact, other than that, uh, we can uh, survive. For Hasia Abigail, the situation is disturbing considering the fact that robbery cases do take place even when police officers are on duty. What the robbers have been doing the way this, it disturbs us a lot. Example, Sundays like this. It, it, it's difficult for us to pass on this way because we are afraid. Exactly by 6 o'clock, you can't pass on this road. Yeah, so it, dis, it disturbs us a lot. So they should do something about it for us. We have some police officers, they, they are not serious. If they come, they are come to take money. I don't know. I, I, mean, I think that they know something about that. Because at times they will be on the road and that will happen. Like traders who visit from nearby communities, market women within Yeji are also worried with the situation. Queen Mada of the Fish Buyers Association tells Joy News that the situation is gradually collapsing the Yeji market. We have no market, but this meat market here. Our market is not going to but when the people are coming to the market, they get attacked by armed robbers. So these traders say they are moving to the KJG market. If nothing is being done, the market will collapse at the end. She wants military patrol deployed on the Yeji route to provide protection for traders. We beg government to, as a matter of urgency, deploy the military to the area so they protect the people before something terrible happens. Most of the roads linking these communities to Yeji are in deplorable state. Some of these traders believe that is a contributing factor to the increasing cases of robbery within the area. The terrible nature of the road is a contributing factor. If the road is good, they can't do what they are doing. The road is terrible, so the robbers hide in the bushes and then attack the trader who use motorbikes and tricycles. So we are appealing to government to please come to our aid. In a recent visit of the area by both day and night that's what we've been facing here so we wanted to call on you to speak to the regional police commander to assist us with more men because we have fewer police personnel over here so they can help the police commander here on his part, Bono East Regional Minister indicated that security is paramount on his list of items to be addressed with urgency. I'm robbery in the area. 
especially still within the eastern part of the same Bono East. It's so rampant. Sometimes in an area, it happens four times in a day, which is too bad, and we need to curb it. Luckily, coming from a security background, I believe I cannot talk so much about it now in camera, but trust me, we are going to do a lot of work on it. We are going to have a RISEC meeting immediately to have a preliminary discussion. In the interim, we have started looking for logistics, which will soon be ready. Reporting for Joy News, Anas Sabit, Yeji.